Ah, peace be still. Hello, oh brilliant ones. Keeping life interesting. Well, how do you keep life interesting? With God. Take the Endless Book, for example. The Endless Book is you, by the way. You know, you read a book and it's like a real page turner and it's like, oh, this is awesome. And you know, you get to the end of the book and it's like, wow, that was a great book. I mean, the, the, the characters were great. The imagery was wonderful. The plot was beautiful. I hope that author, you know, just keeps writing books. Well, God has already started writing the other chapters of the book while you were on chapter one. So he's, I mean, once you finish, he's got another one, another one, another one, another one, another one, and it's endless. Why is it endless? Take the expanding universe, for example. When God, at the beginning of creation, said, let there be light, light travels at 186,000 miles per second. So once he said, let there be light, the universe has been expanding at that speed for, since he said it. So however many seconds you've been alive, all you have to do is multiply that by 186,000 and you get how many miles the universe has been expanded, has expanded since you were born. Uh-oh. So, I mean, that's really interesting. <laughs> Keep life interesting by staying with a person who is interesting. And finally, the one who knows you better than you know yourself. If God says you can do it, you can do it. Get on out there on that ice, open up that cake recipe and get to cooking. You'll be happy you did. I mean, why? I mean, for instance, if you were to make a robot and you designed it so that it could walk on water and you put it inside the manual that it could walk on water and someone bought the robot, but they never, they never read the manual, so they never could enjoy and say, hey, my robot can walk on water. What can yours do? I mean, but if they didn't know it, I mean, if they didn't consult you, if they didn't hang around with you, you wouldn't be able to just say, you know, by the way, that, that thing can uh, walk on water. I mean, you don't have to go out there and get that ore. I mean, the robot can do it for you, buddy. But I mean, so that's why we can stick with God because he knows us better than we know ourselves. I mean, those hidden dreams, those hidden talents. I mean, if you're like, supposed to be a rock climber like we're talking about Mount Everest type rocks like way up high I mean you're really supposed to do that and you're like born in Alabama I mean only God would be able to let you know that hey you're a rock climber you <laughs> you can be the most famous rock climber the world has ever known but I mean so that's why if you want to keep life interesting you have to stick with God the endless book the endless author he always has new things planned for you that's why we live forever I mean He's got a plan. I mean, he's steady writing and the expanding universe. Hey, oh, it just expanded. How long has this video been going? And of course, the one who knows you better than you know yourself. So get out there, be excited, enjoy life. And you want to know how to keep it exciting is keep it exciting with God. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious on you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Bye.